So hi guys, right, the great ball strikers, what do they have in common? Well, when we're looking at their shoulder plane, regardless of whether they swing high or low, they're always situated in just about the same position, 41 degrees. Have a look at that position at the top, and then coming in and bringing that club in behind the hands. Right, now let's have a look at Tiger Woods here. Up to the top of the swing, what's Tiger got? Draw a line down from here into the ground, 40 degrees. And it's just uncanny seeing this shoulder plane. The hands are sometimes high or lower, but they're always bringing this club in behind the hands, and that toe of that club is pointed just slightly on this side of 12 o'clock. Every single time. Looking at tour players, great ball strikers, shoulder planes down around 40 degrees. And even back in the day when we're looking at some of the great ball strikers of all time, Hogan at the top of the swing here, the shoulder plane also down at 40 degrees. Getting your hands on great information, having a look at what the characteristics are of great ball strikers makes the game so much easier.